Hi everybody, welcome back to Borderlands 2. My name is Mikey Dubs and today's randomized Roguelands video, we are playing Salvador the Gunzerker on patch 1.0.9. After talking to the developers, uh, they let me know, oh, was that a Druk? Oh, a Vladov Druk to start and a cooldown right relic, that's nice. After talking to the developers, Pyrex and Jolts dude, they let me know that the, the one and only change in patch 1.0.9 is that after you complete the mission objective, um, whether that be kill 10 enemies or kill 5 enemies in the boss or what have you, you cannot die. You get god mode. You cannot take damage. And so if Assassin Oni drops grenades after you kill him, congratulations, you're not going to die as long as you have killed enough enemies beforehand. Let's take a look at our skills. See if we get anything powerful. Looks like we do get some stuff to increase our gun zerking. That is always a nice sight to see. I'm happy to see it because a lot of times you end up with a build where you don't have a lot of gun zerk. So it looks like we got some really nice skills. This right side tree seems like the one for me. Uh, the middle tree, a little bit of defense, a little bit of reload. Okay. I think this, this skill tree looks like a little bit more like a skippable skill tree for now. This one on the left, Unstoppable Force is nice for, for kill skill. And Willing's nice and Reaper is nice. Okay, so I'm going to start with this this right side skill tree i'm gonna put f some points in ward and hope and pray that we can make it uh through this early game without taking too much damage now the vladoff droog should help me out with that but that right side skill tree seems pretty pretty nice okay there's no crit damage on this bad puppy so i don't have to I could go for a muck a muck or double sniper, but I'm afraid I'm going to be chewing through my ammo too quickly. Let's just do this build right here. This should be fine. Let me head out there. So this right side skill tree is going to 100% allow me to... Oh, give me that. It's, go it's going to allow me to... How did that happen? I need to get to my other two weapons. Hopefully it's not messed up. Eh, it is what it is. Let's just try to see if we can get some kills here. Are the two tankiest enemies in the entire game? <laughs> Just kidding. Imagine if it was the, like a rabbit skag and a gallant spider ant. Holy moly, that would be insane. Okay. Not so bad. And I was playing with Anarchy just before, so right now my reload button's a little bit messed up. Go down, go down, go down. Thank you. If I can get through this round without having to kill that gallery and spider around, I'll be a happy boy. This guy is so tanky. And you would think, oh, like a rabbit guy, like I'm sure, like with how much armor he's got, you would get so much reward for getting crits. And and you and you you do to an extent, but not as much as you should. Eight out of ten. Let's kill this brawler and then go spawn in some more lads. Okay. Now, what I didn't see is a whole bunch of damage skills. I mean, I've got a long gun zerk, but we don't... I didn't see a whole lot of damage skills. So, let's just kite this guy back here. Might as well spawn in some more lads to see. SMG gun damage and sniper rifle damage. Ooh, how about that sniper rifle damage? Oh, another gallant and spider around. Anybody else? Anybody else home? Anybody smaller? Hey, how about you? Oh, come on. Why are you knocking me about? Go down, go down. Can't see you, but you gotta die. Thank you. Clean. <laughs> By clean, I mean not very clean, but it is what it is. Let's go ahead and go to my keybinds. And change star to R. See, a turtle shield, expanded shield, a spike shield. Um, None of those are looking that nice to me. Ooh. It's like that fire weapon. So, yippee ki -yay. Very nice. That's gonna give me a longer gun zerk time. And then, of course... Um, last longer is going to be quite nice too. And there's class mods that buff both those skills. So that's what I'm looking to get looking to do here. Ooh, a rock ravager. That's quite nice. A shock Snyder. Okay. What we could do now is go Droog left hand, ravager right hand. That's matching grip as well. Unfortunately, it, it is bladed, but you can't always get what you want. Let's see. Nope. Nothing quite there. And with that being said, I can take off this... I can take off this sniper rifle gun damage and just pop on cooldown instead, I think. Looking for a class mod that can buff our, our cooldown right now. 
Cost mods? Mm, nope. Okay, let's roll. I mean, a, a, a slag droog is a very nice get in the early game. Don't get me wrong. It was a pretty good slag option. Here's an adaptive shield. Wow, that delay is just out of this world. Don't want that. Lob slag grenade. Let's just do this one. It's it's long bomb. Oh, what is my other grenade though? Yeah, this one's a little bit better. I didn't even slag him, but this is what it is. All right, Gunzerk me. With the PKA, we should be able to keep our Gunzerk up a little bit longer than usual. There we go. That's a, that's the main weakness that I've been dealing with while playing Gunzerker and randomized Roguelands is just having super small Gunzerk duration. Mm, I don't see the one I'm looking for. Hmm. I mean, th the extra gun damage will be better than what I've got now. Gun damage, shield capacity, health regen. Is it minus shield, shield capacity? It is, but health regen in general will be decent. Alright, Spider-Man Pro Creator. I think he's got a chance to spawn in lads. And those lads can be loot enemies. So hopefully... This guy spawns in some decent lots for me. All right, elemental relics, please. Don't mind. Assault rifle damage. Max health. Nope. Go down. Not bad. Three shots with a ravager. Holy cow. That isn't bad at all. Oh, now you're running. Now they running. See ya. And then you're next. Yeah, three shot ravager goes pretty hard. Mm. Not a big fan of that. Let's just keep it rolling. There's a pressure plate over here that I'm going to want to grab. I'm looking for... I mean, I've got a decent weapon combo to start the game off here. Maybe something a little bit more flexible, though, than this Ravager. Okay, there's a regular Droog. Diversification is a nice shotgun, too. It's, it's times one, which makes it super good for Hyperion. All right. Maybe not the best enemy to use my slag on, but here we go. 13 out of 15. Do I see any loot enemies? Oh, I see a, a legendary... A tortoise shield. I just... I don't know if I can get behind a tortoise shield. I'll take it, but I don't know if I can get behind it. Hmm. I really wish I had gotten some... Something a little bit different there. Okay, so let's go for I'm ready already. There we go. And now we can go Metal Storm. We can go down, not out, which is really nice. Wait, this isn't this isn't last long. I have last longer and I'm ready already. Holy cow. Yeah, this go tree goes crazy. Yeah. So my cooldown is going to be ridiculously low for now. And if I get in a cooldown relic as a uh, class mod, which is the one I'm looking for. Hmm, didn't get one here. That's okay. We can move it along. Let's rock. The Badlands. This should be a nice, easy stage as well. Oh, by nice, easy stage, I mean incredibly difficult stage because we're fighting a ultimate badass. Let's toss, let's toss some grenades down. And, and a tubby skag. Okay, the, the loot could be crazy, but the difficulty is through the roof. There we go. Good crit, good crit. Come on, keep up the damage. Yes, he's gonna go down. Good. I'm slagged out of my gourd, but... Go kill that. Now we kill that Tubby Skag. Alright, Tubby Skag, you owe me. I just wanna let you know that you owe me. Okay, we need to kill somebody easier here. Go. Now it's just me and the Tubby. Just me and the Tubby. I see some heal juice to my left. I'm gonna grab that real quick. Oh, you do owe me, don't you? Legendary Hoarder. Okay, thank you. Like that. Unfortunately, the Legendary Hoarder doesn't buff up any of the skills I currently have, and all it does is give me Team Bullet Regen. I don't really need it unless I go double Droogs. So sorry to the Legendary Hoarder. I mean, I will be putting it on if I'm running a gun that's, that's, that's just burning through my ammo, but right now I'm not, so. And the Droog does, but it's only... It's, it's doing fine.
Wait, how about some cooldown? Ah, uh, still no cooldown. That's a little bit crazy. Do a little bit of reload speed to max size. How many times can I shoot this bad puppy now? I can shoot it five times now? Jeez. That's definitely better. Okay. I'm liking where we're at. What grenade did I just equip? A rubberized Tesla? Yeah. I think that's probably got some more juice than what I was using before. How then I hit? Guys, I'm, I'm over here. Thank you. Yeah, the amount of shots I get right now is ridiculous with this shotgun. Holy cow. Let's see, slag damage and shotgun and pistol max ammo. Okay. Here we go. Is that another tubby? No, I thought I saw another tubby. I'm gonna say, hit me up with that noise. Here we go. Fossil down. Here we go. Nice, easy round. A long rider or... Oh, actually, this, this development could be good. I think we definitely go Metal Storm here. We also have Salt the Wound for even more shotgun damage if we want it. With how much extra mag size we get, that, that fire shotgun could actually be really, really good. We also have Steady in this skill tree that I saw. Yeah, Steady for... Do I have even more splash damage somewhere else? No, I don't think I see any. Dude, there is some splash damage in, in, in Steady, which is good. Okay. I think I already got this, right? The guns on the ground in there? Yeah. Okay. Yep. I just wanted to make sure. Okay. The loadout is looking fairly decent. Let's use this. Now we got double shock launchers if we want. And heading to the next round, it might be a boss that I can kill off rip. So let's just grab this extra, these extra pellets. Two. One. Okay, usually it isn't a boss you can kill off rip, but... It was a, it was a good idea nonetheless. All right, let's see how many if we can kill any, as many guys with this with the Ravager as we can. There we go, got all three. Get this guy. We go. That guy. Fire. Hope they spawn. I lost my extra pellets, but we saw how much the potential. If we get it like a Gragnos or something like that. Hey, get out of here. Okay, not bad. See you later. Not a bad start here. We're too early for a grenade. Oh, perfect. Actually, perfect timing grenade. Oh, come on. Why are you juking? I was going to say perfect kiting, but not, actually not perfect kiting. Here we go. Got through you. There we go. Easy round. What'd you drop? A love thumper? That's... That's just shameful of you. Okay, so... I, I think Last Longer definitely has juice. And we are going to go back and shoot all these Psycho Masks. Ooh. Oh, man, I really thought I might get something good there. Looks like I already got that mask. I'm looking for... Definitely I'm looking for better grenades. That's why I'm, I'm going to be... Oh, come on. Something good. I'm looking for better grenades and such, so. And a better shield. This is going to be a nice get for me if I can go grab these uh, Psycho Masks. Good jump. Psycho Mask number two. Psycho Mask number three. Speed run it. Open up, bad boy. No thanks. Heading into this first raid boss fight soon. I, I don't really think I have what it takes. See if I get Pyro Pete or something like that. 
We're looking for something that can help us out. A slag bouncing Betty is better than nothing. Dang. Not really getting what I'm looking for. I, I'm looking for, I mean, a longbow slag transfusion with a 0.0, .0 second fuse time and as many projectiles as possible is, you know, the goaded setup. Those things I would accept beyond that. I mean, this the slag bouncing Betty isn't bad. But a CDR class mod? I think I'll take that. Immunity to electric damage as a... Sh from a shield perspective, is quite nice. Go. Not bad. Ultimate Badass Marauder. Hopefully I can do enough damage to him before I die. Ooh, boy. Don't, don't die. Dang it. And the, the worst part about these guys is they back up so much. Go. I can Gunzerk while I'm fighting for my life, which is a huge get. An absolutely huge get. For a fight for my life and just overall survivability. There we go. One more enemy to kill down here. There we go. And now here comes the the lad. He's in his defense form. I don't really want to fight him too long while he's in his defense form. Let's grab this, that, and that. Come on, bro, get out of your defense form. The, the, the worst part about his defense form is that he deflects bullets. Okay, you stay right there. Oh, how's that hitting me? If I had more co cooldown reduction, this would be a lot easier. My sniper's almost out of max ammo, so I'm gonna hope for some max ammo from here. And then Gunzerk. Come on. We're almost there. There we go. Got him. Not too bad. I'll make sure I grab all my chests. This this uh, Christmas present back here is gonna is gonna mean a lot for this run. Okay. So we take I would say is there anything that we really want more in these trees? I don't think so. I mean, the only thing I really care about down here is willing. I think Steady has a certain something that I want. A certain, what the French call, I don't know what, je ne sais quoi. Alright, pop this. Alright. How about a... A Cobra, something I like. Deputy's badge, something I like even more. Hmm. But I just don't I don't necessarily see this try catcher getting the job done better. Okay, so let's slap on this deputy's badge. And then we can run a lot of different shotguns in my right hand. Yes, okay, a little bit of cooldown rate with some EPKA. Take that and let's roll. Is it going to be better than the max size and reload speed? Probably not. Probably not. Let's get a good box roll here. Plus mods. Okay, Legendary Berserker. We're going to do one more box pull here. Okay. Production Cleaner and Nirvana. How about one more box pull? We, ha we do have a Legendary Hoarder if we need it. Okay, Hector's Paradise is kind of trash for gun zerking purposes. Let's go for shotgun ammo. Let's go. What are we going to get? This is going to matter a lot. Terramorphous, not bad. Here's what we do. We slap on our... I think this... This setup is fine. And we go Lyuda. I mean, so we go Droog, and we go this this development. And honestly, as much as I want to use this one, I honestly think that this magazine size and reload speed one goes a little bit harder. I can fire this thing a bunch more times. 
I can only fire a total of how many times? Oh, man, I don't know if it's better. When my when my gunzer goes down, I'll slap on the cooldown right one. What's my grenade? A Tesla? I think I'll do better with a transfusion here. Alright, let's go. Don't bring it on. It's not bad damage at all. Keep it up. Stop hitting me. Okay. Like where we're at. I could rock the Nirvana. I'm back, homie. Okay. Good stuff. And so, now that it's over, let's go for this Legendary Berserker class mod. And cool down right as well on that bad puppy. And I think it's just Nirvana time. That's only one slap. Only one slap is fine. As long as he doesn't go for like 13 slaps, we should be fine here. Come on. Good. Good stuff. Oh, nice. Nice rock, lads. Okay, I'm really close to the edge here. Ooh, okay. Kill this guy for EPKA if we can. There we go. Got a little bit more Gunzerk time. It's definitely resisting my slag, which I probably should just go for double fire guns, but... Is what it is. Down goes Terramorphous. Need something good here. Maggie, a Seeker, bad loot. A Tadler or a Florentine? All right, so we definitely go with Florentine in our left hand. This is the same, basically the same combo that I ran last time. That is pretty funny. I do have SMG gun damage. Okay. I have a video on the channel called The Running Gun, or it's something like, you know, this play style is too much fun, and it's basically just two SMGs, and it's the Florentine in one hand, and it's the Nirvana in the other. And I just run around with them. <laughs> But until I get, you know, I mean, the Ravager is Dece. I'm not against it. If I run to a zone where I need it, I can definitely use it. But the Florentine's definitely gonna, it's, it's, it's a really solid offhand weapon. It doesn't give me anything crazy broken like a Lady Fist or anything like that, but the ability to shred shields and uh, apply slag is a nice combo and then my right hand I'm going to be switching up basically as quickly as possible I mean I like I do like the Nirvana but it's just not the best mm, yeah shock drew could be good okay here we go this is a, this is just a tried and true combo. We can just use this for the time being. Go. Especially with how long our guns are, cause it's gonna last for now. There we go. Watch him burn. Easy. Did you drop something? Looks like you were glowing. It looks like you're not glowing the right way. Metal Storm on sale is pretty sick. Makes up for the fact that I, I don't have locked and loaded for the extra reload speed after, or extra fire rate after reload speed. Oh man, Tunguska. I mean, I take you, but I don't want to use you. Give me this Florentine. I think it might do a little bit better for me than the... Nirvana, just because a lot of these guys are gonna have shields. Go. 
go. Got my action skill back. There we go. That's our, our defense comes from the action skill. Anything else in here that we really want? I mean, elemental elation goes pretty hard. It's going to give us a ton of fire rate, like a ton of it. This middle tree is pretty nice, too. I mean, it's nice for grit and smart letter faster. But I think let's do the nth degree and then we can go unstoppable force after that. It's going to really increase our movement speed on kill. It'll be something we're looking for. Decent shotgun. If we get high pierce, we'll be happy to have it. Oh, what's in here? Another Snyder. Pop this. A mouthwash. If we get toothpick, then we got ourselves a nice combo. What's nice about Sal is that you, you, you can prioritize hitting the box more than other characters because of how much ammo regen you get. The slag damage is okay. SMG max ammo. Don't think I need it. That's the whole thing. Like I can regen if I need to. I can always put on the legendary hoarder class mod if I get low. Okay, let's rock. Let's rock today. Get some high ground right off rip. I haven't seen a loot enemy in a while. It would be nice to see one of those. Outer monkey, don't you start messing with me. There we go. Nth degree. Should we start deflecting some, some bullets towards other enemies? Go down, go down. Oh, how am I taking this much damage? I'm not too sure. Who's down here? Man, this the, the amount of burn damage we're getting is kind of ridiculous. We more than likely won't need any more uh, guns, Zerk, so I'm going to look around. Oh, there's a red chest in here. Okay. How about behind here? Pressure plate? Mm-mm. I think I know where the pressure plate is, though. I hope, anyways. Okay. The legendaries. As of right now, because I don't have money shot or anything like that, I don't see any of these these blue class mods outperforming. I can't see anybody over there. Go down, go down. Thank you. Yeah, but be because of our our elemental damage, I think elemental elation would go kind of crazy. Almost ran past this right here. So now we can go ahead and grab um, Unstoppable Force. Gage's kill skill. That gives us our shields back and gives us movement speed after kill. And I think that's inconceivable. Oh, Immolate as well. Nelska's willing. Like the Wind, Reaper. You know, this is just this good stuff all around. Incendiary damage and incendiary damage. Well, we take the 35 percenter. Is it going to outperform SMG damage right now? I don't think so. Simply because it got two SMGs. Right, so underneath here, I think there's a pressure plate. No. Really, I thought there was. Well, that's what it is. Uh, okay. Is it up there? No, it's not up there. Hmm. I really thought it was in here somewhere. Okay, well, let's just go to the next stage then. Can I get a good angle on different locations just to see? No, I don't see it. All right, let's roll. Let's roll. Yeah, so far all I've gotten is... All I've gotten is flesh damage area, so I haven't had a need to swap off. 
Ooh, explosive damage. That's a good relic right there. Ooh, lunatic bombers. Take out those lads real quick. There we go. Kill this grave digger. Some transfusions out. No, how'd that happen? Okay, I can zerk. I can gun zerk one fight for my life. There we go. And the transfusions come back to find me. There we go. Drain that shield. Drain that shield. And slag him. Florentine's super nice offhand weapon. Oh, wow. Didn't even know that was up here. Hop down. Bring the shield and slag. It's just so nice to have both them in one weapon. Oh, don't knock, don't knock my edge. Go. 9 out of 10. Electrified Nomad, and I'm gone. I'm off the edge. What a run. No, if I had gotten that kill, I would have survived. We run that back. We absolutely run that back. This is so sad to die like that. Holy moly. I had a feeling I was going to fall off the edge, and I just did, I did it to myself. Let's get a new seed, and let's run it. Scroll all the way down. I could have scrolled the other way. Look, I've got so many characters now. I'm going to have to go back and delete them all at some point, but let's run it. Dang, that's just a tough way to go. All right, let's see our skills. This looks like the exact same page. Did I not click new seed? Okay, now we got a new seed. Let's go back in. It's the run back. Not everyone can be absolutely perfect. Let's just see what our skills are now. I see cloud kill. I see anarchy. Can I get some money shot for my life? No money shot. We do get Ipikaye, which is nice. I think I start with... Hmm. It's tough. Because so you want to get down to Ipikaye for longer gun zerks and scorn, but... Let's take Cloud Kill. And do we have Keep It Piping Hot somewhere? No, we don't. This middle skill tree is pretty buns. I kind of want to skip to Anarchy, but I don't have a way to counteract Anarchy with any sort of accuracy, it doesn't look like. Let's just, let's just use the better half then, I think. Yeah, the better half. Let's go. And then we can focus on using, you know, something like a shock damage weapon. Shock damage weapons can be really good for us here. Let's see. Explosive damage, a sorrowful damage. Okay. If we can get ourselves a peak opener, that'd be my, you know, my go-to here. With the shock damage and everything like that. And that last one definitely had legs. It just feels bad to not win it. Okay, so a sniper comes in. You're gonna, we're going to be able to get wires don't talk here pr relatively quickly, which will boost up our shock damage. Oh, something slag. Good. Let's go. Bring it on. I'm okay with a run back. Last time I got a run, I had to do a run back. I ended up winning the run with uh, zero, literally in the last video. So I'm not against doing a run back. Yo, got a lot of damage coming in. Every run's a new beginning. It's something, uh, a way to experience new things. Yeah, if I had gotten that, I think if I had gotten that kill, I would have survived. With the one point, oh, a nice fire anarchist right there. Yeah, let's run this. Yeah, yeah. Let's see, a rock torpedo. This fire anarchist is going to be noise. I don't even need to, I need to do anything. Let's just use this anarchist. There we go. And now I can rock it like a pistol gun damage build or something like that. Where's my slag? No slag, huh? Fire is so bad against shield, it's ridiculous. There we go. I want my Florentine back. 
Here we go. Seven out of ten. He's down here. Dude, you're getting you might want to get some high ground, brother. Okay. Not bad. I think points into wires don't talk will be good. I don't want to light myself on fire. And it's gonna be better than burn, bippy burn. And duty calls, so. How do I not how do I not have enough to go to the next stage? Is that weird or what? Only having nine points? I should have ten points. Oh I, I put to one point in cloud kill, that's right. Okay. Shock damage. We do have some shock damage, but even with shock damage, I think it's gonna be better to just go for fire in the fire damage area for now at least. And uh, the shock damage come in handy depending on what weapons we get. More explosive damage is nice. Okay. Longbow slag transfusion with seven, um, with seven little, uh, what's it called? Little healing orbs that go out in a 0.7 second fuse time. That's like, that's basically the grenade of the future right there. Probably will not get replaced. Let's see, corrosive damage is nice. Let me roll out. What do we get here? It's robots. It's robots for now, and then it turns into something else later. So do we have anything corrosive? If not, we can go... If not, we can go shock. Let's go for this shock pistol here. And then... I guess we, we keep the... Uh, keep up what we have right now. Yeah, let's go. The wires on talk giving us that slight boost in shock damage, which is nice. Okay, free kill. Back up. Hopefully this will stun this guy. No stun. There we go, that worked. He's dead, right? Yeah. Get some slag on this guy, hopefully. There we go, swap. Not bad. Reload me. Don't take an extra. Don't take another uh, volley if I can help it. Let's this bad boy out, and the shock damage will be really good against these uh, against these bad boys. Applying shock damage means that they they can't go invisible once their shields are broken. Go down, homie. Once my guns work is back, I'll be chilling. Spamming it. There we go. Apply some slag. Apply some slag. Ooh, I'm getting knocked about for a, a ton here. All right, let's speed clear it. Um, let's go into this left side of the tree for more yippee ki -yay. There we go. Very nice. Uh, max size and reload speed. One of my favorites. I like some cooldown. I think guns are cooldown is really, really nice. But the problem that I have now is I don't have any way to keep my guns or up long term. So if I am going to keep it up, it's going to be luck based. Borderland symbol behind this rock. Ooh, cooldown right. Sec. That slag bandit? Yes, it is. Like that. Like that a lot. This magazine size is enormous. And because I don't have locked and loaded, I don't have to worry about getting extra fire rate when I reload, so. I think we take one of each of these um, one fire burst and one corrosive cloud. Depending on what zones we get, it's going to be useful. Wonder, I don't know where the pressure pad is here. I have never found it, I don't think. It's on top of this. 
No. Man. That's okay. Let's just keep it moving. We already died once in this in this video, so. I won't spend too long just doing nothing. Okay, so let's go back to the fire damage here. Adaptive shield? Take that. Let's see. Coolant rate? Even better. Check. Let's go. See you later. Yeah, I'm taking a lot of damage here, but we should be okay. Hopefully, I can live. Don't run away, Plague Rat. Do not run away. Oh, there it goes. Look at him. There we go. Okay. I think we're safe for now. I think tossing... I think maybe tossing a couple grenades right there would have been a lot smarter. Okay, looking strong. Looking good. So here we're not gonna make the same mistake. Well, we can, I can heal already off of this. And now we just toss, we toss at least a couple of transfusion grenades here. Hmm, they should get kills. I should get second winded. Yeah, there we go. Go, oh, not bad. Keep tossing. Hey, APKIA can't save me if, or can't keep me up if I can't uh, stay alive, so. Keep it rolling. They hate him. Come on, get me through there. Thank you. Bring it on. Yield rat, go down, homie. Nice. Alright, five points. I guess I'll take that incendiary assault rifle. Yippee ki yay, and then we're gonna go into Metal Storm. I could go Numb Nerves, Burn Baby Burn, and and do some Fire Synergies. But I, I just I just don't see it working out for us. How much Fire Synergy do we have? Not a whole lot. It's literally just Burn, burn Baby Burn and Numb Nerves. Which, does the damage reduction actually mean anything? Not really. Not in this build, at least. Okay. What we got here? I mean, we need options. We need options, so we don't want to turn my nose up at too much, but... Not quite getting... Like the, the big the big juicy stuff, but this this next round is when we can actually start getting good stuff. All right, let's roll. Let's see, Sawtooth Cauldron. Okay, this one sh this is gonna be tough a tough match if a bunch of like blasters and stuff spawn in. All right, I'm gonna start with nades first. Hopefully, I don't die. Man, I I cannot stay alive very long at all right now. Oh my gosh, I, these guys move way too much. I can't, where is he? I, I can't see. I can't see him. Where is he? Oh my gosh. Moving so much. Go down with this. You too. Gosh, man. Guys moving so much. Thank you. I want to save the extra pellets for next round if I can, if I can help it. It's a really important power-up to save for next round. If I get someone like Saturn or something like that, where I get access to fighting them right away. Okay, that's a large lad. Come on, get slagged, get slagged, get slagged. How, man? I just, just how? Is it? Oh my gosh. There's another lad right there who's even stronger. Yep. Lost this. I'm gonna die. It's over. I'm alive. Come back to me. Come back to me. Come back to me. Heal me up. Heal me up. Heal me up. 
He's closing the distance. He's closing distance. Woo! Oh my gosh. Life flashes before my eyes. I'm fine. This is going fine. Heavy Nomad. Got him. Holy cow. Okay, let's get this boss spawned in while we got Gunzerk up. Okay. If this guy puts us down, he runs for the hill. So we gotta, we gotta really focus him down now. Good. Good shred. Good shred. Good shred. Come on, keep it up. Nice. Not bad. Give me a strong unique here that I can reach. Okay, I got it. Holy cow. I would I would have gotten really upset if I couldn't have reached that. Okay. That was a tough zone. That was a very tough zone. Got a good power up for next round, though. I'm out of storm. Scorn. And let's take one point and five or six shots. Inertia as well. Let's grab inertia and start heading down this skill tree. I don't really care for anarchy right now. I don't. My accuracy is already so bad as it is. Yeah, bouncing Bonnie is nice. A slag bouncing Bonnie is really, really nice for slagging purposes, but uh, now I have scorn. So I can, I can slag on my own now. Even though my override cooldown rate is pretty up there, so maybe I do want more slag. And I am slagging. I've got, I've already got a slag gun in my hand, most of the time. But if I can get, you know, if I can, if I can get different uh, sources of slag, that then I can change my gun out, you know. And any Moxie gun will will work. Okay, this is exactly what I'm talking about. Got some extra extra pellets against the most important boss of extra pellets against. Anything corrosive that isn't a shotgun? So I can fire quickly? No, I don't think so. All right, spawn in, homie. Okay, I I swear I hit the right weapon. Okay, don't waste time here. There we go, one shot. And that is why we do it the way I did it. Alright, so. Inertia into get some. Very nice. Alright, how about a grog nozzle for your lad? Something to spice up this run. Orphan maker? An orphan maker is really, really nice for my left hand. Hopefully there's something strong up there for me. Yeah, because Orphan Maker is a, is a really high-powered shotgun that does damage to me, but if I put it in my left hand, it doesn't actually deal damage to me. Oh, what you got up here for me, homie? Anything good? Mm. He's upset that I one-shot him. He's like, yeah, I'm not going to drop you anything good. You cheated and, and used the candy. Sorry, bro. No, it's not your fault. And it's not my fault either. To be clear. And I'm down for an orphan maker. Don't get me wrong. Just hoping for something a little bit, you know, on the the better heal side. I mean, we, I mean, this does give us an opening for a, a decent weapon pairing. So we can go orphan maker uh, left hand. And we can go bad touch right hand. And with this extra magazine size, we can we can kind of push this orphan maker to new heights. Where'd I go? So how many times can I shoot this bad puppy now? Twice. Okay, the, the reason that's not damaging me right now is because I've got because of the patch 1.0.9. Um which makes it so that you cannot take damage after the round, after you complete your objective. Let's see. Rosa damage plus 42%. Not bad. We just got to make sure that our good touch is in our right hand. And then we should be fine here. We are going to hit the box, though. Um, just because Dwarf Maker doesn't eat up that much ammo, honestly. 
And we're looking for better gear kind of across the board. A hornet can be a good weapon. Come on, one more pull. Boss mods? Legendary Berserker? I think Legendary Berserker is, is going to be better than what I was rocking. Let's go. Didn't even spend any SDUs, but it is what it is. All right, we go back to Terra. Right back to the well. Bringing on to Mr. Terramorphus. Terramorphus. Got a lot of cooldown right now, which is nice. Kill skills are kind of popping. We're going to get right up on this guy. I will use Scorn to see if I can slag him, but the slag isn't going to last very long. Come on, Overmaker. Do your job. Do your job. Not doing a whole lot here. Yeah, and the, the bad part about it is that my gun search doesn't last that long, so... Realistically, it's just not the best fight for me. I can go Fremington's Edge with a little bit of incendiary damage. Do I have any? Don't. I can try to go Fremington's Edge and chill back here for a second. Ow. Jerk. Gotcha. Thing is, just go back to my original setup here. Stop hitting me. There we go. That's not bad damage right there. I really need to start hitting some crits, though. Worst case scenario is this guy knocks me off the map, which I don't want. Not a bad snipe. Really lacking, lacking damage right now. And okay, we're back. How did that happen? I thought I, I went to my... There we go. There we go. You're gone. Oh, if I get, if I get smacked, I'm gonna fall off. There we go. Ooh, gosh. Come on, Orphmaker, get me there. Supposed to be like this highest damage gun in the game. Show me what that's all about. That's what that's all about right there. Something a little bit more than that from you. Uh, I'm in trouble now. Spam the button. There we go. No, wrong. How did that? I swear that the weapon swap isn't fast enough. Ooh, tough fight, tough fight. Stop it. Uh, start we need to start tossing. Big time. I need, I need something better. Something better. It's, it's not strong enough. A Brachny, maybe? Maybe a Brashnik gets us to where we gotta go. Okay, we dodged that, which is good. Okay, stop that. It's a lot more damage than what I was dealing with earlier. Okay. Not bad. Okay, that's, that's a lot more damage, actually. If you please pop back up while I have Gunzerk. Thank you. Much, much higher damage here. Some EP Kaye action going. Thank you. Don't knock me off the edge. Not bad. Okay. He's, now he's going for multiple slaps. You're gonna, you're gonna regret those multiple slaps. Stop it, stop it, stop it. Oh, oh, I'm alive, I'm alive, I'm alive. I'm dead. I'm so dead. I can't see. I can't see what I'm shooting at. 
Can't see what I'm shooting at. No, they're going underground. Uh, launcher me? <laughs> oh, I'm so back. So back. That was never even a doubt. There was never a doubt in my mind I, I was going to make it back there. Definitely was not planning the outro. Definitely was not planning the outro. Stop smacking me, homie. I'm trying to hit, I'm trying to hit the crit spot, but it's not possible right now. Okay. Down goes Terra. Not an easy fight, but we made it through. Orphan Maker could have done a lot more for me there. I need something good here. That's the second time getting the secret in a row. Okay, Antagonist is a nice shield. Stop that bad puppy on. The Orphan Maker should... Should do better in a mobbing scenario, I guess. Especially after I hope we get a deputy's bat or something like that. But I don't know if I even trust it in that type of situation. This was not bumping. Without money shot, I don't think it's gonna be, you know, as strong as it as it could be. Oh. Yeah. I'm not sure if we're anointed this run. You have to make it through to tier three. Tier three is where you get all the good stuff, but how many box hits did we get? Doing. We didn't get really much of anything. Okay. There we go. Nice. Okay. We 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 continue on. If we really wanted to get anarchy, now would be the time. Now would definitely be the time. Mm, is it worth it? I think it could be. We grab Anarchy. There's just not a whole lot along the way that I really want. No kill like overkill sounds nice though. I think that we probably I'm gonna try it. I just don't I just don't see us getting there without it. Mm. Let's do fancy mathematics. Auto loader. I'm the juggernaut. Able. Five or six shots. Anarchy. That should be good enough from there. Now, the problem with this go tree is, yeah, I want the, yeah, I want you to be Kaye. But everything else is just atrocious. Whereas this go tree has a lot better stuff. It also has typecast Alcano class, which is going to help me stack up faster. So I think we just kind of eat. I think we just kind of... Oh, do not start with me, brother. Do not start with me. I think we just kind of... Oh, he hit me. Uh-oh. This is going to be a rough zone. Come on. Just go down. Don't hit me again. Don't hit me again. Don't hit me again. He didn't hit me. It's not even near me. Oh, my gosh. I'm, I'm, I'm so torched here, man. I'm so torched here. I can kill that cursed pirate. That'd be sick. Did I kill him? He is that sick. All right. Go right back. Right back to where I was doing before. Stacking up anarchy as fast as we, as best we can. Okay. We're still alive. We've got five anarchy stacks. Okay. Hold on a second. Can I, we can maybe pull this out. I bet we've been in worse situations than this. Uh, maybe not. Hit four. Blast them. Hit one. Run for my life. 18 anarchy stacks. 18. Could be a lot worse. 
Come on. Blast this guy. Blast this guy. Hey. 24 anarchy stacks. Oh, man. Hey. We stay alive. We stay kicking. That's what matters. At the end of the day, that's what that's what's gonna get us to the end. Just staying alive as long as possible. What is my reload button right now? Keybinds, keybinds. Let's make it star instead of R as we go to stack up our anarchy. The extra cooldown is really, really helping out quite a bit. It almost comes right back up, which is super nice. And this is when I can have a chance to get Deputy's Badge, which could be even better. Maybe. Okay, don't have to make that decision quite yet. I think we start off with some grenades. I think that's the, that's going to be the key here. Start off, start off with some grenades and then go, then go buck wild. More grenades, please. Go. I don't have any more. That's not good. Yeah, not terrible, not terrible. I gotta land the shots, though. If I don't land the shots, I'm doomed. Yep, I'm, I'm doomed anyway. Not good. Hopefully get out of this as quickly as possible. There we go. I'm alive. 36 stacks. We're doing it. We're alive. Okay. The healing isn't isn't that great, and I'm getting I have to get right up and close and personal with these lads, but hopefully with something like typecast iconoclast, we can stack up way, way faster. Absolutely nothing to show for on this pressure pad. The tier three, they go way, way harder though. Something to look forward to. Yeah, this build is not is not it right now. But we know we're trying. You know, we're, we're out here. We're doing the thing. Hope is that if we can stack up Anarchy fast enough. That we could be off at the races. Now I'm not swapping to Corrosive Damage yet. But I will be swapping to Corrosive Damage soon. Okay. Start, start shooting. Here we go. Get right up and close and personal. Oh come on. The knockback effect is just too much go here we go he's gone don't knock me back okay i need to start chucking some nades i'm slag i gotta be super careful here just wait for my action skill here we go and now i think what would work best for me is to switch over to this overcompensator Swap these two just in case the, it doesn't affect my left hand and go corrosive damage and just try to kill this guy as quickly as possible. Get a quick reload off. Take a ton of damage there. Hopefully we can heal through it. Okay, we do kill him. I'm, I'm dying. I'm dying. Yep, I'm dead. Oh, but oh, 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 we're so back. That's the craziest part. We're so back. Yes, okay. 54 stacks. That's more than nothing. We're really good against robots with this was over in Compensator. Sick. Now, what can we do? If we can find the right chest, we can stack up our Anarchy to all the way right now. Yes, it's right here. Now, do I have a good shotgun for it? I do. I got an Orphan Maker. And I can't take damage after the round's over. The Orphan Maker is going to be just fine to just spam right now. Let's do it. Now, with Typecast out Conoclast, this is going to go faster than it usually goes. There we go. And let's go for... Do you have any reload speed I can grab real quick? Doesn't look like it. I think maybe... What do you think? Grit or Mylan? I, th I think it's... I personally think it's Grit. I think it's inertia first. 
then Mylan. Let's just blast this thing a bunch of times. I'll see you guys in a second. Okay. Speeding through this pretty quick. I'm noticing that once I get to the bottom of Typecast Iconoclast, or 150, now I basically have wasted points now because Typecast Iconoclast is no longer going to help me. But if I do go down, it'll it'll help me stack up faster. But it is what it is. We want, definitely want to go back to our heal juice weapon, I would say. The heal juice is extremely important. Okay, I did pull that. I did get that Borderlands symbol back there to see if I could get myself a, a deputy's badge to make that reload speed go even faster, but it couldn't. Go back, drop this, go back to Legendary Berserker. Okay. Maybe I should shoot this. No, it's already full. All right. Looking okay. Keep it moving. Three Horns Valley. Oh my gosh, immediately start taking damage. Okay. Not cool. Not cool at all. Oh my gosh, I can't see anything and I'm gonna die. Can't see anything and I'm gonna die. Reload, homie. Reload. Thank you. Go. Need to get over this guy. There we go. Do I still have my corrosive damage relic on? I do. Let's, let's go back to our, my cooldown rate relic. Stay alive. Stay alive. Uh, 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 uh. Staying alive. Uh, uh. Can't see anything. Taking millions of damage. Yeah, the reload speed. I, this gun just is not it when it comes to. Come on. Take these guys down. Take them down. Take them down. Take them down. Oh, okay. We're so back. We're so back. This Orphan Maker is just not it. I need something that can do more damage. Is it really the Street Sweeper? Is it really just a, a regular old bandit shotgun? I don't know. Yeah, it seems to be a little bit better than the, than the Orphan Maker, just for that one round, I guess. All right. So the reload speed is going to be so, so, so important. I think maybe I can, with that, I can go back to the Orphan Maker. But I don't know if I trust it. Getting closer to Tier 3, though. One round at a time. But I don't have to beat next round. All I have to do is beat this round. Looking for Borderland symbols here, though, for sure. such a small zone i feel like it's gonna be easy to find i haven't fought here and i don't think i mean it's been forever oh here it is don't go flying that one flying i might jump down there for that iridium iridium is gonna be so so important i really want to max out on it I think it's worth grabbing. Let's do it. I mean, next round is a boss round. We are making it. Up down here. Oh, it's not going to let me. Dang. All right, well, let's roll out then. If I can't go down there, how come the Iridium can? There, I said it. Okay. Where's that reload speed at? Yeah, this is just, just absolutely awful. But I'm, I'm hoping that if I can get really up close and personal, that I can do a ton of damage. But it, it looks like even when you are, it's just not. That's the craziest thing about it. Even when you are up close and personal, it's still not pumping it. I could just say screw it and just go full corrosion. Oh, come on. There's no way I go down here. There's no one even around me. There we go. Did say screw it and go full corrosive damage? Yeah. Way stronger. Way, way stronger. What is that? It's a twister, right? I can't tell. Okay. Yeah, way, way better. Holy cow. Now we're talking. Just, just use corrosive damage, brother. 
Elemental matching. Overrated. Oh my gosh. Don't 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 talk to me. What did what did that guy drop? I need to check my backpack. Here we go. Let me scroll down. Where is it? I thought I saw I thought it was a twister or something. Did I not pick it up? Is it still in the water back there? No, it's this rock salt. Oh. Well, let's just stick with my corrosion damage for now, I guess. Cross this bad layer down. Yep. It's it's really not terrible damage. Realistically, it's not terrible. Go down, homie. Come on, get me out of this. Oh, I'm gonna die. Is there any way out? Is there any way out? Holy, there is a way out. Ooh. Okay. Everything is fine. Easiest run of my life. Easiest run of my life. Where is this lad? It's right here. Who needs elemental matching? Not me, that's for sure. Let's go, baby. I don't even mind that the shotgun's talking to me. At least it's pump pumping damage. You know. Oh, come back. Yes, come down here, homie. Yes. Sick. Don't speak to me. Okay. The reload speed. I think... We need all the help we can get, but maybe it's the better half. The extra fire rates. It's just a... Just an absolute blister of a zone uh, run right now. Trying our very best to get things done. I mean, we're, we're doing our job. We're adapting. That's what it's all about. Forget using the right elements, brother. Who needs them? All we have to do is make it to tier 3. And a peak opener will drop, and then bada bing, bada boom. We can also spec into... Overload. And then nothing will stop us. We'll go all the way up. Whew. Not a bad run. I think the Anarchy Stacks was definitely the way to go. Feeling a lot more powerful. The Orphan Maker got to put up a better showing than what it's been doing. I think with money shot, it's probably a lot better, but for now... For now, I snooze on that. Okay, bring it on. Do I have any damage for these lads? Oh yeah, I got plenty. Let's go. Okay. Switch to this lad. There we go. Keep it up. Don't let him punch me. Don't let him punch me. Where's my transfusion grenades? Come on. Oh, I'm so back. I'm so back. I'm so back. I'm so back. I'm so dead. Yep. Wow, that's how the run ends. Crazy. The one the one boss fight that's that's still completely bugged out. Doesn't work the way any of the boss fights else else work. Not even on patch 1.0.9. You know what? We struggled. We we scratched, we clawed. And in the end, we had a decent run, and realistically, we didn't even die. We died to the we died to the game. We didn't even die to the enemy as well. I'll see y'all next time. If you enjoyed, hit the like button, subscribe to the uh, channel if you want to see videos similar to this one. And I'll see you next time. Bye.